Hello everyone, it's me, your mom. Occasionally, I get questions about how I do my little tarot card follower alert. Looks like this. Pretty cute, huh? This alert is super easy. I use follower alert variations in stream elements to do it. So I'll take you through it step by step now. First thing you're gonna need to do is log in to Stream Elements on your browser. Stream Elements has a whole overlay functionality that we're gonna use for this alert. When you log into Stream Elements and you go to your dashboard, on the left-hand side, you'll see a tab that says My Overlays. You can click on that and then you can create a new overlay. I called my follower Alert Overlay, Alert. Inside my alert overlay, you'll see I've added the alert box widget, which is one of the default widgets that you can get for your stream elements overlays. You can find it by clicking this plus sign and going to alerts and then clicking on alert box. That will create this box for you here. When you click on the alert box on the left hand side, you'll see a couple of options pop up. Under settings, you'll see options for all of the different types of alerts that you can get using stream elements. So if I click the gear next to follower alert, you'll see additional settings show up just for follows. Down here, you'll see there is a variation settings tab. And if I open that up, I have all of the major arcana set up as follower alert variations. So if I look at the Fool, for example, and I click on the gear, you can see all of the settings for the Fool card. I've set the card picture, my card pull sound. I can change the message that plays. So for example, here it says the name of the person that followed pulled the Fool. I decide how long the alert lasts whether there's TTS, et cetera, et cetera. I can also include custom code if I'd like. And I set the percentage chance to 100% because I want it to be equally likely to pull along with any of the other cards in the set. And when I'm done editing this variation, I can just click save variation. And you can see at the very bottom of the list of variations, there's an add new variation tab. So I can click on that and set all of the settings as I go step by step. And then at the very, very bottom, it says here, pick an alert randomly when more than one matches. So check the checkbox here. So that means all of these alerts will always match because they're all at 100% likelihood. So it will choose one at random. And that's how I do my fancy tarot card follower alerts. Looking pretty good. You can use alert variations for anything. You could have subscriber alerts work that way. You could also have your tips work that way, depending on how much people give or all kinds of stuff. You can see in the tips section, I have no different variations. But in the subscriber section, I have different variations depending on if they're resubscribing or if they're giving a community gift or what have you. And these are all set up by default by stream elements and I can edit them however I see fit. And also duplicate variations, all kinds of stuff. If you've ever wondered why I don't have all 72 tarot cards set up, that's why because it would just take a really long time. <laughs> I hope that's helpful for you, and I hope you learned something. If you did, please like this post and feel free to share it with your friends. Enjoy your streams and good luck. Goodbye.